And then it's just dun 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 dun. dun, dun, dun. And it's got a grab attack. Hey guys, Gunshy Mari here with another video, and today we are going and taming up a death worm. Oh yeah, and today we're gonna be taking Dez with us. So the way I remembered where this death worm was was via this Titan. In that rock. So if this guy's also really close to home, so I didn't actually even have to go far. But it's right up here in the desert. Alright? Okay, so I know he's in that rock. Basically, that's exactly where last place I saw him moving was that rock. So, thanks to no one tameables, death worms are tameable. And the way you do that is via this. So, I don't know what that shadow is. So, what we're going to do is we're going to place down, if I can... Oh, I see concavenator or just dust i hope i'm hoping just dust okay we're gonna place down a trap like so these are death worm traps as you can see they are significantly bigger than your normal creature trap significantly they are massive now what do i need to do here is hopefully aggro this death worm like so now we got to keep this guy following us into the trap he needs to pop up basically in the trap so if i land right basically if i hover right in here what happens i want him in the trap like that like that there we go so they'll pop up it'll close up like that and then boom They'll slam down. Now, to tame these guys, you're going to need three death worm horns to feed them. And it will take three at a time. Now, I also highly suggest a sanguine elixir. I don't have one right now on Dez. Okay. Now we got that guy up on this. Let's get some blood packs for one of these. So that way I don't have to do this three times. I only have to do it two times. Luckily, there are a lot of vultures around as well. I could just go start eating and chomping on this titan. But I feel like that'd be a bad idea. Also, I want to keep an eye on you. Did you go back in the ground? Yeah, you went back in the ground. That's perfect. Okay, I'd like that tight or that death room to starve down another hundred or so before I go at him. Okay, now we can go back after the death room. I've gotten enough blood for sanguine, and it is starved up enough to that I like. Now, I think a perfect spot for it would be basically right here where we uh, where we last saw him or when we first saw him. Okay, now, we're going to pop it like that and we're going to wait for the trap to open up. And then we'll pull the death worm over, hopefully. And this doesn't go horribly wrong. So, I'm hoping the death worm has starved up enough for me to feed. There he is. She, she. I realize I've been saying that wrong now. It is a she. There's also acros near my base, which is awesome. They look so awesome, the, the scorched ones. They do, honestly. The scorched acros are the most, like, the best looking ones out of all of them. Or, well, second best, second best. Alright? I got a feeling it was one of the other ones. I think it was either the Eden one, if there is an Eden one. Or one of those other ones from a different map. All right, come on, pop, pop, pop. Perfect. There we go. That is our death. Where? What? In the heck? Land. Thank you. Okay, this is our death worm. Let's feed him. Wait until hungry again. All right, I guess we can pop the sanguine on him. Um, you're not hungry yet. We still got time. As soon as that. Alright, we can't feed him anymore. Oh, time to go. Time to go. Time to go. That's a nice 75%, though. When do I feed him? How low do I have to wait for him to drop? Okay, so I've been waiting quite a bit of time. This Phoenix legit just rolled up on me. 
So I think now we're going to try this. But I don't really have a clear landing zone. Here's the clearest we're going to get. Space. E. Do I got? Yeah, I still got one more. This is our last trap. And then I have to run home and craft another one. That's the only that's the last one I prepared for because I knew these guys would probably take three at 150. So hopefully oops. Why am I like sitting here waiting for him to move? I need to get his aggro. Right, come on, bro. Use your brain. I guess I was technically waiting for that to activate the trap. Basically, like, chill in the ring of the trap. They gotta pop, basically, within the trap. So, like so. Here we go. Please, please, please eat. Please eat. Please eat. Yes! That is our first... That is a tamed death worm, people. That is a tamed death worm. Oh, my God. I want to get up close and personal with this guy. Okay, I got it now. We can do this. Death room saddle. Now, Dez, you don't got anything too important. Let's get you crowded up. And then we were going to hop on the back of this death worm. Alrighty. Ooh. <laughs> this is just a giant scaled up beef. Was it the frog saddle? You thought you could get away with this. Okay. Uh, it's got into that attack. What if I... What, why can't I move? There. That is why we can't move. Ambush cooldown. Okay. I wonder if I could bypass that real quick with a cryopod. Okay, I figured it out. I figured it out. I couldn't figure out there how to burrow and unburrow. It's space bar. I should probably try jumping with more creatures like this. But, like, legit, it just burrows like that. And then we can... Oh, we can glide really quick. And then it's just... Dun, 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 dun. And it's got a grab attack. I didn't know the grab attack just pulled things under and you just, you just consume them. Oh my god. That is... That is quite, quite more horrific than I thought it would be. Oh, there is a cooldown on it. That's the ambush cooldown. Okay. So I can't, I, I'm pressing C right now and it won't let me. So, which I really should get these guys home. This is awesome, dude. We got our first Alaskan bullworm. Only true fan or only true children at heart will know what that still is. The Alaskan bullworm. That'd be this would be the worst time to figure out to find out. I can't oh. I can't uh burrow into my base. And which it looks like I can. I legit just went over a rock. So can I burrow through this? Yes, I can. Perfect. Then we'll unpark right here. What up, guys? Say hello to your new friend. Oh, that's so silly. I love it. I wonder if I can make them breedable. I know that, it, like, usually with uh, no untamables aren't, but could you imagine this? We bring. Uh, I, oh, that'd be perfect. We bring us. We bring ourselves in our own death worms to the Manticore fight. <laughs>